Hey gamers, I am Centauri Mudpig and welcome along to this vlog. Not decided on the title yet, but it's about God. So if you're already turned off about that, then feel free to stop the video. If not, let's continue, shall we? I suppose the, the whole, to summarise what this video is about, is about giving thanks to God. And just whenever uh, we ask him for help in no matter what we do, that when he helps us, that we thank him for it. Now, some of you out there will probably be commenting straight away as soon as you hear me saying that, saying we should always give thanks to God. Well, yes, you are right. When we're asking God, we should be thankful that he will do it because all his promises are yes. However, I do not want to go too deep into theology at this point. And I just want to talk about an incident that happened to me recently. I was recording some video footage of uh, me playing a video game called Let's Use the Singularity. If you follow my channel, you'll be seeing the videos being going up through a Let's Play series of the Imminent Crisis campaign. And I got to the last mission and I was struggling at a point in it where I was sending a wave of bombers at the enemy's home base uh, trying to take them down quickly but uh, the AI was able to counter my attack force and annihilate them before I could even do any sort of considerable damage to his home base. Now, on one last attempt on this enemy, I gave a short prayer to God and just said, basically like, please help me. And the attack was successful. I destroyed the enemy's home base. I wiped him out. Which is great. Thank you, God. However, I didn't thank him at that point. Uh, I didn't verbalise it, and I didn't even think it. I just got carried away with uh, what was going on in the game and was now focusing on the next challenge. And I totally took my eyes off, my thoughts off, whatever you want to call it, you know, my focus off God. Where the Bible says we should be continually seeking him and asking for help in all things we do. Again, wouldn't really just start to get deeper than I want to. So let's just keep it simple. I forgot to say thank you to him. And as a result, he came up with a way to remind me of how good he was to me, I suppose. And the way he did that was he corrupted the video footage just after that event. So everything was going fine, video was recording, destroyed the enemy base, moments just after it, the whole footage from there on out, corrupted. <laughs> and, you know, anyone who's like watched all my videos on my channel, I think I've only got a couple of videos which I talk about God, but not in video games. And, and for that to happen, has to just be a God incident rather than a coincidence. Because what, well, you know, what are the chances, what are the odds of that happening at that particular moment where the hundreds, if not thousands of hours that I've captured with this software without uh, this sort of incident ever occurring previously, you know? <laughs> And it happens at the moment where I ask God for help and then forget to thank him for it, just moments after. Yeah? So, let you guys decide for yourselves whether that is a God incident or otherwise. But to, to me, I choose it to be. And I think it just serves, as a, it serves at least as a reminder to me just to be thankful when he does 
come through for me. I mean, you can ask God for, for anything, as long as it's within his will, his answers are yes. And, I mean, me, me beating this AI on there, he helped me do it. <laughs> as stupid as it may sound. But yes, I'm a God brother then, if you want to call me that. Uh, I ask God for help in the smallest of things. Uh, what I do at times is uh, I, I sometimes forget and try to do it in my own strength. And have you ever uh, been in that situation where you struggle to do things in your own strength and you can't do it? It's frustrating. But when God's there to help you, you, you know, you, you become an overcomer. So that's all I really want to say. Just remember to give glory to God when he actually helps you. You know, if you, you've asked for your help and he gives it you, or whatever, you know, you, you just, you've just got uh, an abundance of uh, blessing and everything is going right in your life. Don't forget to give him glory. Don't be one of these people who go to God when, when things are going bad. He's always there. If things are going good for you, it's because he's blessing you and he's... And, just be thankful for it. Just remember, he's always got your back. Even if you're in the worst situation now and that everything looks bleak, he will pull through. And I know he will because he did it for me. So if he will do it for me, I'm a nobody. I've got like 200 people on a YouTube channel which I've been running for eight years and is unsuccessful. If he's willing to help me in my life, I'm not talking about helping me with this video game. <laughs> uh, this might be for another video entirely, but I had a really, really dark part of my life. And God has helped me through it. Has he pulled me through from the other end and everything's perfect? No. Was I unscathed through the whole experience? No. But he's put me... He's put me through a situation. He's took the bad in it and he's walked me through it so that I have learned from that experience and that I can use this experience maybe to help others. So don't think it's the end for you at any point in your life because it's not. It's just the beginning. Okay, so I just say amen to that. Praise God. Feel free to like and subscribe. And leave a comment below. Okay. All right. God bless. Bye for now.